Sophie. Thank you. You heard this one is connected. Right. So I was having a difficult time. It's like you have to go. I know. I was using both hands. A class the other night that had royal icing in it and the batch that everyone had in the class was exactly the same. Mm -hmm. And for some people, the royal icing was perfect and stiff and stayed right where it was, and then other people it just. So, what's the difference between the royal icing and the um, corn syrup? <clears throat> this is a little bit more forgiving and it doesn't, it takes much, I don't want to say it takes longer to dry, but it's easier to work with. Whereas royal icing, it's kind of hard to, once it cracks and has that crust over it, once it yeah. cracks, it's like impossible to fix. Yeah. And you can kind of fix it with the corn syrup icing. Yeah. Yeah. So how far in advance do you have to make them if you were going to, like, with a corn syrup cookie? Like, um, you make them the night before, or do you have to make them, like, the I make before? my cookies, if I say I'm doing two orders for that week, one's at the beginning, one's at the end, I'll bake all of my cookies and freeze them, but I won't decorate them yet. But I can make my icing and cookies first. I can decorate the night before, but no sooner than that. Okay.